Shakaya Ross says that her brother Carlos was brutally beaten multiple times at the Dick Connor Correctional Facility. Now today she took those concerns here straight to lawmakers and begged them for justice and change. I'm standing for everybody. I'm not just standing for my brother. A voice for those behind bars. Family members of inmates who claim they're abused spoke out in front of legislators Wednesday. Shakaya Ross showed video. She says shows her brother Carlos being beaten, then left helpless and alone for hours. They beat him with padlocks and it was like 20 of them that jumped on him. The second day, they stabbed him two times. The third day, that's when they did a recording. Carlos had multiple broken bones and eventually surgery on both eyes. His um, nose was broken, his ribs was broken. <coughs> my brother, if I didn't call, I don't know what would happen to my brother. The Department of Corrections told KOCO an investigation was launched within 45 minutes in this case, and the offenders were moved to a different prison. Yet lawmakers like Representative J.J. Humphrey say it's just one example of poor care and response and called for an outside investigation. We knew an assault was occurring. We knew it was a serious assault because it was a stabbing. Now, the DOC says they have put in place a stricter misconduct policy under the direction of their executive director. They say since that's been in place, they have seen fewer serious incidents of inmate on inmate crime.